Hydro, when maple syrup met oil, Canada and Saudi Arabia bury the hatchet after five-year tiff. T-L-D-R. Oh, Canada. And hey there, Saudi Arabia. Following a five-year Cold War, these two nations have decided to let bygones be bygones. They're appointing new ambassadors, bringing a glimmer of hope to the strange trade scene. Was it a hush-hush convo between Prime Minister Trudeau and Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman that sealed the deal? Could be. Picture it, Canada, chilly but welcoming, Saudi Arabia, a desert kingdom, blazing hot yet rich with oil reserves. Two distinct countries that have somehow managed to keep a diplomatic cold shoulder for nearly half a decade. But hold your maple syrup and camels, folks. The ice is finally melting, and it looks like they're ready to play nice again. It seems the two nations are strapping on their diplomatic boots and getting back in the international relations ring. The announcement of new ambassadors to each other's countries comes as a fresh breath of air in a global scene that's been a bit, let's say, tense. But hey, they're trading frosty glares for warm handshakes. Who wouldn't love that? So what could have sparked this change of heart, you ask? Well, we've got our eyes on the recent meeting between Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, yes, the one with the impressive hair, and Saudi Arabia's Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. Something must have happened between the sidelines of the Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation, APEC, Summit. Coffee. Secret. Handshake. A shared dislike of pineapple on pizza. We may never know. All this brings us to the question, what does this mean for trade? The earlier diplomatic kerfuffle had put a strain on things, but now it seems that both countries are ready to turn the page and start a new chapter. Does this mean cheaper maple syrup for Saudi Arabia and affordable oil for Canada? Only time will tell. But, let's not forget, restoring relations is about more than ambassadors and trade. It's about fostering understanding, building bridges, and finding common ground. Maybe a camel race in the Rockies, or a hockey game in Riyadh? Who knows? Now, we turn to you, our brilliant readers. How do you feel about this four in relations? Do you think this is a step towards a more harmonious international scene, or just a temporary ceasefire in a long-drawn conflict? And more importantly, how do you feel about pineapple on pizza?